the main thing here is that everybody is talking about the virus, talking about the stock market, especially today, the stock market has crashed about 140 points. So in normal circumstances, everybody will be saying that this is definitely not the right time to buy property. Like what I mentioned to you here, you see, today I just see the stock market right, actually goes down to 140 over points downwards, which is very normal because today's market, people will start to think, hey, is it the best time to buy or should we wait? And that's the reason why I've done so many consumer seminars. Why? My objective is very simple. I really want to educate people that why people choose to take action during the crisis period. And in fact, actually many people out there actually make the most out of it during the crisis period. But a lot of people choose not to. Why? Very simple. It's because they are worried that the price will go down. So that's something that I just want to show you. Look at people who actually take action during the SARS period. From the period they took action, actually the price went up by 115%. What do I mean by that? That means that if a person who bought $600 per square foot, their property actually appreciated to 1002 per square foot, which means what? $600 PSM difference. If anybody dares to take action at this point of time, actually they make the most out of it. As you can see, the other one, those people who choose to buy during the downturn like Rivergate, their profit margin can be 600,000. Look at another one. This is another one that was uh, done during the North Park residences, which is 2015. Same thing happened. Even a place like Yishun, uh, people take action during the downturn, they make how much? $400,000 over $1,000. So, of course, very important, you look at this recent launch, which is the M. 70 over percent that was sold during the first day. Why? Because of the price. People still queue up five to six hours for what? Pe people scared the virus, but people still take action. Of course, during my upcoming seminar, which I'm going to talk this coming Fridays, I'm going to focus on a few things. What are the three deadly mistakes that a property buyers they should avoid? First, what are the mistakes that people make when it comes to purchase a property? And this is important. If you do not know what will happen, you will probably do not know how to buy. And in fact, you buy the wrong property, maybe you will end up even losing more money. Next, of course, what are the difference between new launches and resale? Of course, timing the market is also very important because why? When we know how to buy, we must also learn how to exit. The last part will be, how do I determine whether a product is worth to buy? Therefore, for those people who really want to come for my talk, I urge you to really, really come for this seminar. What you need to do is very simple. Just register with any of our promexions. They will be able to invite for my seminar. I can assure you in my one and a half hour session, you will definitely have many, many takes away. Mm -hmm.